The house before it was hit by the flood? Oh, it was a cute little house. Had antique wood floors in it, and then the flood hit, destroyed everything. Our, our goal is to rebuild everything that is is possible so that we save every home. It was really a surviving community and now it's 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 going to be thriving. We figured about 109 homes, maybe six or seven were not water damaged, didn't get water in their home. The vast majority I'd say were substantially damaged. I lost everything. Everything meant anything to me. Lost all the pit photographs and pictures and that's the biggest thing when they come home. It's been a long time. They've been doing some amazing work. I'm so pleased. I'm very happy about what's going on. You know, there may be three years of work. I, I my dream is to have it done in two years. You know, we're just determined to rebuild every house. We're, we're rebuilding the community, not just individuals, so we're helping everyone. I mean, I just heard somebody say it the other day, we are better off because of this. And it was devastating. I mean, they lost everything. But we're able to rebuild the houses, so they're safe now. We're rebuilding them better and stronger than they were. Before, it was kind of a closed community. You know, everybody kind of kept to themselves, and now it's amazing. Everyone will tell you, like, oh, my helped so-and-so I didn't even know him before. We're pretty strong. I think we will hang on. We got a lot of good people out here. <laughs>